everyone, so today I'm doing the 8 most worn tag. I was tagged a while ago by Addiction to Shopping. She's a really really nice girl, she makes um, beauty and fashion videos here on YouTube and she's from Australia. I'm sure you've all heard of this tag. It's really really old and I'm sure I did it way back when I first started making videos but obviously my answers are going to be different. If you don't know what this tag is about, it's basically 8 categories and you say which is your most worn thing for that category. You'll understand me as I go along. Okay, so the first question is what is my most worn perfume? And I have two at the moment um, for different reasons. Um, first of all, my most worn overall perfume is definitely Couture Couture by Juicy Couture. Um, I used to wear this like every day and I still wear it a lot. Like It's probably my favourite perfume that I own. Well, one of my favourites. This is like the special edition packaging. I got a new one recently. Um, and it smells amazing. Like, I'm really bad at describing scents, but it's really fruity and sweet. And kind of smells a little bit like um, wine. Like, that really... I don't know. It's really classy and I love it. And then this one here. This is called Can Can, I think. I always get mixed up. I say Cha Cha sometimes. I don't know why. I think it's Can Can by Paris Hilton. And I like celebrity fragrances because they're all like really like sweet and stuff. A lot of people don't like celebrity scents. Um, I like scents that are very um, kind of girly. Some people would call it like immature scents, like teenage scents or whatever. I don't like hard out musky scents or anything like that. This one here just smells so good. My boyfriend really likes it. Again, I'm really bad at um, describing scents and everything. But it smells really sweet, fruity, blah, blah, blah. And this is what I've been wearing almost every day for like a couple weeks now because I just got it and I really like it. The next question is what is my most worn nail polish? And I'm not much of a nail polish person. I'm starting to get really into nail polishes now. Um, but the one that I would always wear because I could kind of get away with it for work is called Subdued and it's by Sinful Colours. That's how you spell it, Subdued 311. Um, and it's just a really kind of nude um, pink. And it kind of just looks really um, undetectable, I'd say, on your fingernails. It's like pretty and girly, but it's not like screaming out, hey, look at my fingernails kind of thing. So I really, really like this. And it's probably my most worn overall shade, even though I'm starting to get into different colors now. Okay, the next question is most worn shirt. And I'm going to generalize this. My most worn shirt is white. Um, I always wear white shirts if you haven't noticed already. Um, and then most worn kind of shirt type, I always wear these kind of chiffon um, see-through cute little baggy tops. And I love this one. This one I got from Easy Buy. Um, I also have another one that I got from Max, and I have another one that I got from Supre, and I've been wearing them so much lately, they just go with jeans, high-waisted shorts, high-waisted skirts, just like anything. Okay, the next question is my most worn earrings, and that would be these ones that I'm wearing now, and I wear these like almost every day. Um, Amy, Amy Couture X3 sent me these ages ago as like a gift, and I love them, they're so amazing, and yeah. They're really pretty. They're just like little flowers with a little diamond thingy in the middle. And they're kind of like aluminium material. It's really cute and I just think they look really girly and feminine and cute. Next question is most worn shoes. Now for me, um, I just picked my shoes that I wear on a day to day basis to like class. I go to uni and obviously I'm not going to dress up and wear heels or anything like that. The shoes that I wear like day to day are these ones here they got from Kmart. You guys have seen these in like heaps of my outfit of the days. They're just flats. They're kind of reptilian like, if that's what you would call it. Um, and they have little studs on the front that are falling off. And I don't think there's really anything special. They look cute with anything, like with jeans or whatever. And I like pointy flats. Next question is my most worn lipstick. And I have two because I'm cheating. Um, these two I have been wearing the most lately. Um, and the first one here is called Plain Koi. And this is by MAC. It was released with the Quite Cute Collection. And that's the colour just there. This is my favourite lipstick like ever at the moment. Or any other one I'm going to show you. Um, I wear this like every day. It's just the perfect like light pink for me. Um, on lots of people it's like a nude. But for me it's just like a pastel pale pink. And it's amazing. And I wish I could get another one. But it was the mid edition and sold out. And I'm really really sad about that. And the other one that I love. This is so beautiful. I love it. This is the Black Label Lipstick by MAC. I mean not by MAC. By NYX. So I just want. 
I think I just wiped lipstick on my top from my swatch. Anyway, this is called India and it's the Black Label NYX lipstick. And the packaging is cute, it's just got like lace detail on it, if you can see that. And the colour is like this. It comes off more pink on your lips. I'll just swatch it. That's the colour there. So you can see it's similar to Plain Koi, but it's more peachy toned. And it's so pretty. Oh my god, I get compliments every time I wear this. Next question is my most worn handbag. And I'm not the kind of person that has like a billion handbags at once and like swaps them and stuff. Because I have so much junk in my bag that I, you know, have it all in my bag and then I'm never going to like change it until my bag breaks. So this is my current bag and you've seen it in my What's in My Bag tag. It just looks like this. And I got this from Glassons. It was like um, on the Boxing Day sale. It was only $20 reduced from like $60 or something random. And I got this and then they got a like wallet for free. So it was pretty cool. It's just got these like gathering details and then it's got like tassels which are falling apart um, because I have given this bag hell. But I just like it, it goes with everything. I really need to get a new bag though, as I said it's starting to fall apart so I think I'll get a black one next time. And the last question quickly is most worn hair product. And I have two because I don't use either of these often so I don't really know which one is my most worn. First of all is Fudge One Shot and my mum got me this bottle. I've had a couple of bottles in the past. Um, I've had this for like a year now. Nearly. Nearly a year. I got it for my birthday last year. So it was like 10 months ago. Um, and I have a little bit left. But this is basically a moisture spray. So you just spray it into your hair. And it smells amazing. And it just comes out like this. And you put it in your hair. You spray it on your hair. Not on your hand. And it smells so good. It smells kind of like kind of coconutty and sweet and really good um and it just makes your hair shiny it adds some moisture because my hair gets really 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 dry and the next thing is the batiste tropical dry shampoo is that how you say it batiste batiste i don't know but i got this when i was in ireland and i really like it for when um like just I don't get oily, but if I'm just feeling like my hair is just a bit limp, um, this really freshens it up. You just kind of spray it into like, you part your hair and spray it, and then you just wiggle your fingers into it, and it gives you that little bit of lift, um, a little bit of volume, and it just like, as you can see now, my hair is like freshly washed this morning, and you know, it's nice and light and flowy and stuff. Um, so if my hair is just feeling a bit bleh this kind of freshens it up if you know what I mean so that was my eight most worn tag um I think I should tell you now I bet you'll have questions before people even finish watching the video but on my lips I'm wearing this elf lip stain in red carpet um because everyone always tells me Shannon get a red lipstick um so I got this and I think it's all right I'm not sure if I'm digging red lips on myself but Hopefully it'll make you guys happy. So if you want to do this tag, or if you have done this tag, leave it as a video response down below. Make a video response. That would be cool. And I will talk to you guys next time. Bye.